Are you stuck trying to extract emails from raw data using keyword research? If your answer is yes, then you are welcome because in this video, I am going to show you how to use keyword research to extract emails from your raw data. My name is Kojun Kete of SaaS Media Studio, a media and a digital agency. On this channel, we create lessons relating to business and marketing, website development, affiliate marketing, and also making passive money online. Okay, so you kindly subscribe. We upload videos every two days, so and sometimes every day. So kindly subscribe, okay? Kindly subscribe, okay? So at the description down below, I have my social media handles, okay? You can get to me with their personal questions or at the comment section you can give your questions or your suggestions at the comment section okay so now if you are ready get some cup of cocoa and let's move on Make sure you watch to the end of this video because at the end of this video, I am going to share with you the best email extractor, okay? Email extractor that can extract the data, okay? That is, um, that is a tool, okay? It's a tool. This tutorial, I'm not going to use any tool at all. So that is it. So make sure you watch to the end. At the end, I'm going to give you a few tool that can help you to do. Remember, uh, in this um, lesson, it's just um, um, a keyword research that you're going to do. Okay, so we are going to do everything by ourselves. So now the question that pops up in our mind, okay, especially when you are a beginner, is what is email extraction? what is email extraction now when we talk about email extraction basically you are going to fetch out some emails in a particular website or on a particular website or in a particular data okay so uh, you go to google you you get a lot of data on google like uh, facebook has a lot of data Okay, people have created account with uh, with Facebook and they have their emails names on those platforms. I mean, on Facebook. So you are going to ditch or fetch out that emails from that data from Facebook. Okay, so in this case, we are not going to extract on any particular website. So in case you have gotten a raw data in our Microsoft Excel, how are we going to extract data? on that particular okay so i'm going to show you a scenario on how um the the data is okay there is a mixed data but we have um emails in that data okay so we are going to try and take out those emails okay so let me open my problem and we solve it okay so as you can see let me just push this somewhere okay so as you can see we have um 41 emails in this um, document okay but you can see it's an email but um there is a lot of mix up okay there are things that is not going well so you cannot see the emails really really well so as you can see at the first one we have official tutorial kojo ketia at gmail.com okay at gmail slash tutorial dot um dot pure dot is it pure test yes so we are going to try because the email you can see it's at okay and since it's at g we know that it's gmail.com okay so what is missing okay so what is the real problem so let's study okay case study let's study the first and the first can help us to um to solve the rest okay so the first okay so we can see slash okay we can also see slash over here we can also see slash over here we can also see slash over here so upon my observation i can see that there is a l missing over here so you can see the gmail is l but the l is missing over here okay so that means we have to find a way to to change this um to L okay, so we are going to change this slice or slash to all. So, what we are going to do is uh, we click on the I think um, the column okay, the A1 um, function or whatever. 
yeah it thinks it's a function with it so you click on that and you see the a1 box so you click on um home you make sure it's on home then you click on find and select okay and click on replace okay so you are going to use the replace method to replace everything or anything missing in this document okay so now we can see that um this um gmail l is missing so that means they have changed or the l has changed into slash you get it so we are going to click uh, we are going to find slash and make sure we replace the slash with l then you click replace all so yes so as you can see excel has completed its search and has made 113 replacement okay so that is it so that is it so click on okay so as you can see official so you can see that this is now official tutorial okay so now when i study this again i can see that tutorial is almost everywhere okay so we can um yes so let's see okay okay so upon this case study i can see that the official where, where, wherever there is l there was a tutorial over there as well okay so you can see the gmail there is a tutorial over there as well so now we are going to find space and tutorial so you can see there is a space before the l okay and tutorial so click on um i think um there is so okay the space and tutorial okay so there is a white space and tutorial we are going to replace that with um, um i think nothing okay we are replacing that with nothing at all so you clean everything here click on replace and select so you can see excel has completed search and has made 73 replacements okay so now as you can see we can see the official okay so i official the l is no more than the tutorial is no more also there okay then then we have after the gmail we can see it was l okay and after the l there was a tutorial and the tutorial is no more there okay so it has been solved okay so we are going to study it again remember that an email ends with a domain extension okay as we can see we all have gmails over here so if it is gmails and we see gmail dot one pure test that means that um the dot com is missing in this case okay so we are going to implement i mean com is rather is com rather okay so because we can see there is dot over there so com is missing so we are ha then we have to make sure we replace i pure test we, we have to replace that with com you get it with com so um just type in i space pure test okay then you make sure we replace to come then click replace all okay so maximum cannot find any data to replace okay okay so then that means it's not i it is l okay so let's click let's change this um i and, and just replace l and click on replace all okay so as you can see Excel has completed its search and has made 40 replacements. Click on OK. So as you can see, it is now complete. Uh, the first one is official kojo at gmail.com. Okay, so that is it. So you can still go through. Okay, so you can still go through. So that is it. So as you can see, you have this um, is a double L. Okay, we have to take off this l okay so you are going to take off gmail and gmail with double l and replace with one g uh, gmail with one l okay so gmail okay with double l oh sorry gmail with double l to replace with gmail itself okay then click on replace so one was replaced which was the one i saw over here so uh, that is all okay so i'm going to um i wanted to okay let me test out okay i want 
testing okay everything i want to test okay so i'm going to test out this email whether we have been able to extract in that email from those junk of raw data okay so i'm going to copy this or then i'm going to my browser then i'm going to send an email to this okay um so to um testing okay so click on send then okay so the email has been sent so i'm going to check if the email has been delivered successfully okay so as you can see shadrach Arthur mason that is my name testing as we wrote okay so when i click on this email there is nothing in it okay the subject only what was testing so that means this email is working you get it so that is how you can extract emails using keyword okay we entered few keywords and that keywords was able to determine or identify and replace okay was able to identify and what replace so that's how you can use keyword research to extract data okay i promise that i'm going to give you an email extractor tool okay a free tool that can help you to extract emails but before i do that at the description down below i have my number one best way of making money online just click on it and check it out okay and secondly please i want you to hit the subscribe button if you haven't okay subscribe and also uh, give me a like because i love likes okay just like a lady tells you i like you see how you feel yeah then give me a like okay so the email extractor i'm going to give out to you is um email x discovery vip .com, okay so if you have a lot of data okay with emails you can just come and paste it over there and it will extract those emails from that data okay yeah, that is it so one thing is this cannot solve the problem we solved okay that is it but if there is email there is email okay without any mix up this tool can help to take it off okay so i'll leave the link at the description down below if you have watched to this far i want to say thank you and congratulations please subscribe and we are going to meet next time goodbye please 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 you can buy me a coffee at the description down below and also at the comment section goodbye